Hey everyone, it's Nightlight9, and in this video I'm going to be doing my pulls for Tifa on her anniversary banner. I'm very excited to get these uh, on the way because it's the character that I wanted most. Uh, not super thrilled uh, with the weapon as far as like, I guess comparing it to the ideal that I built up in my head about what it could be, what the possibilities were, uh, but I still do want it and I think that I'll get a lot of use out of it. Also, my account is, is decently strong. And so even as a sub weapon, this is an amazing weapon. Um, and yeah, for that reason, I'm pulling for it. Now, just to kind of show you uh, the wish list that I have for anybody who cares, it's kind of the same stuff as I've been putting on there uh, previously. A couple Sephiroth swords. I only need one more copy of the Shinra military sword to get it to OB6. I only need uh, two copies of Shell Knuckles to get it to OB10. So those I just kind of like to finish off. Citric Wand, I think, is going to be great for Ice Teams, and Rose Musket, I think, is going to be great for Magical Fire Teams. That's the wish list. Now, for those of you who watched my last video, you would know I got a lot of wish list stuff. I did not get uh, copies of Aerith's Wand. I had to go back in in order to get it to OB6 after two pages. It felt pretty bad, so I'm really hoping that my luck is amazing on this banner because OB6 is the goal. I'm willing to go through two pages. I don't know if I have enough crystals without purchasing more to do that, but I would consider stopping maybe before two pages if I just drew OB6. We'll just have to see. Let's go ahead and do this. Um, here we go. Two stamps off the bat, better than normal. I'll take it. Now, one thing I didn't do in my last video, I actually skipped this first animation and normally I do watch it all the way through. I don't know if that's bad luck. I don't really believe in jinxes or things like that. However, it was pointed out to me and I did have a bad full session. So I'm going to start by watching that first animation right here, uh, just because hopefully it brings the luck that I need. Okay. It's not about that first pull being great. It's just about doing the same thing as usual for those of you who are superstitious. Stamp luck, not, not uh, too amazing, which by the way, if the stamp luck was good, I don't really need to hit a lot of the weapon considering there's a lot of uh, free copies on page two. Oh my gosh, and starting off, not, not the greatest start to uh, the pull session here. Again, OB6 is the goal. That's what we're looking for. Okay, this should be a three, four, all right. That, that is always good, and that's going to get me both um, a guaranteed, which has 19 point something percent chance, and uh, a guaranteed copy of the weapon. So looking to hit two copies of it here, I would be very happy with that. And it looks like only getting one. <sighs> Oh, I got a Rose Musket though, and I also got, I think, one or two of those in my last pull session. So that is getting close to OB6, uh, which I would be uh, pretty happy with that. Although I don't actually plan on using it for its C ability as much as it's a sub weapon. So there is that to also keep in my mind. Two more stamps, I'm okay with that. This is our fourth pull. Oh my gosh. All right, so far have not hit a uh, five-star weapon other than the two guarantees that I had. Fifth pull, trying to keep track of these. Not usually very good at it. One stamp, terrible, terrible. Oh my gosh. All right, well. I, I don't I don't I don't know what to say about this right now. Not going great. Not going well. Oh shit! All right, sixth pull here. So it's going to take seven pulls to clear the first page, which is not the worst as far as stamp luck, but I it's not amazing either. And so far, I've almost cleared an entire page or entire card, and have not gotten a single five star that wasn't guaranteed. Feels pretty bad, I can tell you that.
Okay. We got a couple Sefs and we've got a Tifa. This is at least trying to even out the luck. A Shell Knuckles. Okay. I mean, it's that's one more closer to OB10. I only need one more to have it OB10, which would be great for my Magical Fire setup. Um, I got the Shinra Military Sword that is now OB6. And I got another Blue Ramble, which is another thing I need for my Earth teams. I'm going to have to readjust my wish list. Um, but for those of you keeping track, seven pulls and I've gotten three five stars now thanks to the amazing luck on the last pull. Okay, back at it. I replaced that Sephiroth Sword with Marine Shooter from uh, Lucia for physical fire teams. Um, something that I've been trying to keep in mind. So there we go. We are back at it on page two. Eighth pull overall. <laughs> One stamp. Okay, another Sephiroth weapon. Oh, and I... Is that... Ao Navy? <laughs> okay, okay. Well, um, ninth pull, and after this we have three more left before going into Red Crystal Land. Oh, man. This is it's kind of hard to keep the energy up here. I'm not going to lie. Um, just can't get the featured weapon without it being guaranteed, it seems. <laughs> oh, I keep hitting five stars now, which is great. Um, man, I really would like to get a couple copies of this, though. Okay, okay. At least I'm hitting some five stars, though. I'll be honest that the majority of that first page was... I, I haven't seen, I think, pulls that bad since uh, Guide Gloves, maybe. But they are milking the crystals out of me on these stamps. Okay. All right, two. I guess I should be extremely excited about that at this point. This is another five-star guaranteed. Again, 80% chance not to get it, 20% chance, give or take, to, to hit it. Okay. Two Tifas. This could actually turn it around pretty well for me if I could, if I could hit, I don't know, double. One would be even pretty good at this point. And we did. We hit the shell knuckles and we hit the gloves. So this, uh, okay, I'm happy about. And this is OB10. I'm going to have to switch the wish list up one more time. All right, we're back. I uh, switched out that shell knuckles for um, another Yuffie weapon as a sub weapon. And that is Razor Ring. It has a 52 on its Earth R ability uh, at OB10. And so basically trying to set up Sephiroth to be my main earth damage dealer. And so that's how I made that decision. All right, I've got one more free uh, crystal type pull and <clears throat> we're just slogging through it, uh, trying to at least get the rest of these guaranteed copies uh, so that I can get pretty close to OB6. I need three more stamps to clear this page. All right, another Tifa. This could could be it. No, wait, it's guaranteed, so it has to be it. All right, and there's one of the newest weapons I put on there. I'm gonna go down to some item boxes here and see if I can't uh, maybe get enough crystal. Eight hundred. All right. Wow. Okay, I'm I'm pretty excited about that. That was really good luck, I think. Okay, so real quickly, as I'm trying to preserve these red crystals, if I can, 2,500. Okay, that gives me another pull. All right, let it continue. I need three stamps to get my next guaranteed copy, and then I can reevaluate. Oh, this is not a three. It's a two. Oh, okay. Man, okay. I've lost track how many pulls this was, by the way. 
But we're going to have to probably do one more. I can't leave a guaranteed one stamp away. Never pulled an ultimate weapon either, by the way, um, throughout any of these banners. So I guess anybody who has pulled one, you should just really understand how, how lucky it is to hit one of those. Uh, because I've pulled quite a bit at this point and still not been able to hit one. Gonna have to do a little bit of thinking about how I want to do the crystals here as far as this last pull. Um, if I'm going to make a purchase with the red crystals or how I want to do that. Just a second. Okay, I'm back in the shop just to show everybody, I guess, what I'm doing. Uh, normally I would do this on my own, but I know I need to pull this. So instead of going for one of these, I'm just going to come down here and get this. Uh, it basically cost me... 2,500 less red crystals, and technically it's just better value because I get 10 stamina tonics out of the deal, and I just don't plan on doing more than one more pull on this banner. Although I think I am going to spend the 3k to do the special one because I've had really good luck on those. Um, so we'll see how that works. Three stamps. Man, that's what I needed on the last pull. Here goes. Well, I did get the, the guarantee that I was supposed to get. I didn't get anything else, uh, which is, is fine. Okay, so I've gone ahead and spent the parts that I had to easily uh, start up. I'm at OB4. I have enough to take it to OB5. So... I'm going to, again, kind of gamble. I could spend 5k to get a guaranteed copy, and I will have OB6 with the parts that I have. But I've had really good luck on these, um, so I am going to draw this. So far, I've hit, I think, three total. I think I hit two on Cloud and one on Aerith with this. Hopefully, I can hit my one copy that I need. You are guaranteed a five-star, and so I know that I've got roughly a 20% chance of hitting one. Let's hope that it pays off just like the other ones did. Oh, it's Barrett. <laughs> okay. So, uh, yeah, didn't, didn't really go the way that I wanted it to, but I, again, the luck on this banner in general, not, not amazing for me, especially considering I didn't really hit many featured um, weapons on Aerith's banner. In fact, I don't think I hit any. Uh, and I did hit, I think, at least one on this one. I think I think I did. So, um, I guess now I, I, I feel like I pretty much have to spend the rest of my uh, red crystals here and just get the guaranteed copy of it. I hate having to do this, but there's no reason to stop at OB5. Pick this up. And uh, that'll be OB6. Pretty lackluster end to my anniversary pulls. However, that's just how it goes sometimes. Um, at least I did hit it to OB6, which was the goal. I'm wiped out now. I'll have to start rebuilding for whatever Halloween banner comes out in case it's something really great. I hope your pulls go way better than mine if you decide to do this. Again, it's up and down. And you know what? My cloud pulls were pretty amazing. So... I still don't think it's the worst thing in the world. Um, I hit the OB6 and that's all I really cared about. Uh, let me know how your pulls went. Subscribe for future content if you're not already. If you are, I appreciate each and every one of your support. As always, thanks for watching.